We got a quick preseason this year with, with playing again February 12th in Texas. We're excited to open up. Our guys are doing a great job of working hard and showing up every day. Uh, ready to go. They, you know, they show up to practice. We got great leaders. They work extremely hard. They hit well. They do what we ask of them. So we're just excited to get going right away. The last two weeks of preseason so far have been very, very competitive. Um, I know guys are very excited to get on the field. I know it's been a quick turnaround since coming back um, from winter break. We only have about three to four weeks of practice before we head down to Texas. Um, so I know everybody's looking forward to that. We want to give our guys a great experience, and, and we take a lot of pride in giving our guys a championship experience at Stevenson. We wanted to go to Texas and, and open our season against what we think is one of the best conferences in the country. You know, a lot of three of the last five national championships have come from the West Coast, so we want to get to the West Coast and see what a national championship experience was like. And we're excited just to go out and, and play a really good team, which we know has been on the field as well, and see what we are. And then we'll get back to practice and fix our mistakes, but hopefully we get some, uh, some quality results out there and uh, be ready for our season. We have a lot of games, uh, six nine inning games, varsity nine inning games, so it's gonna be a lot of baseball. Pretty regimented, um, but at the same time, we're still gonna be able to have some fun. I think the biggest thing is just team chemistry. Our guys get off campus, they're able to be uh, full-time baseball players for a week on spring break uh, and, and just do a really good job of getting to know one another. We're excited about the trips and then we're going to play great competition. Uh, one of our big things is again we want to compete at a national championship level so we got to play good competition and we're going to play great teams from the NJAC down in Florida. We're just excited to play against those kinds of teams. I'm just looking forward to playing some some high competition this year. Uh, we have Salisbury and, and Hopkins especially on our list and then of course York in the conference so I just can't wait to, to play against these guys and show show the conference and show what we're built on and what we have this year. So I'm very excited. Playing 13 teams who are in the top 25 or receiving votes. Uh, and then we play the reigning national champions in Salisbury. We play Hopkins, who uh, was in the World Series last year. We play Scranton, who's an NCAA tournament team. And it, it prepares us for a great conference. I mean, we think that our conference, top to bottom, is extremely competitive. We know every single day we have to play great baseball. So. I think we put together a great non-conference schedule that will prepare us for April in our conference schedule. This senior class was the first group of guys that, that I recruited when I was here. So I'm extremely excited to see you know, all the work that we've put in the last four years pay off. Um, these guys do a, a great job of embracing our, our values of being selfless and caring about one another. They compete their butts off. Like when we told them that, that we were going to go play in Texas and we were going to play a really tough schedule, you know, they were like, hey, let's bring it on. You know, they know what the expectation of our program is and they believe in it as well. And from a coaching standpoint, we, we lay the foundation, but your leaders have to believe in it. And that's what I'm excited about this year is that our leaders believe in, in our expectations and, and what we're preaching as well. We know we're going to have ups and downs. That's the awesome thing about baseball is you face adversity. Uh, so can we get out there and, and fix the things when we don't play well for a week and not allow it to be two weeks? Um, and, and we really think that, that we have a group with our leadership that can handle the adversity and get back after it and, and put together a good, a good streak of wins as well. When we have our full team, we're going to be a really tough team to beat and I think we'll surprise a lot of people. Uh, I'm just really excited to get after it this season.